as we think about the world of generative AI, this is a concept that has grabbed all of our attention. AI has been around for many years, decades even, but it is only in the past year that we've suddenly seen with ChatGPT and Dolly and other new interfaces that AI has become accessible to the rest of the world. Do we have to open up analytics for the vast majority of employees who have lacked the data and analytics training to use? So we've spent the past, oh, decade plus looking at self-service analytics, looking at reporting, trying to figure out all of these different ways to be able to act, make data more accessible and make analytic outputs more accessible. And we have this opportunity with generative AI, this ability to be able to ask questions and be able to get answers back in, in a manner that the normal human being can understand uh, to be able to bring generative AI and analytics together. So. Let's think about current trends in generative AI. One of my favorite quotes around this new idea of generative AI is that the hottest new programming language is English. For the first time in computing history, we have a natural language, a normal language that we all learn can actually use to affect data. And you no longer have to learn SQL, you don't have to learn an object-oriented language, you don't have to learn how to actually figure out how to code, you can simply ask questions and then all this magic happens in the background.